I really like Milwaukee's cordless power tools. In particular, the M12 size that all take this same size battery. And these lithium ion batteries do seem to last quite well. I think part of the key to that is to make sure you take these inside in the wintertime, don't let them freeze. The 2410 uh, drill driver, this is the 2411 hammer drill driver. It would appear that some genius at Milwaukee has decided to discontinue this particular model. And, and that's a shame because the chuck on this drill is far superior than, than the chuck that's showing up on this 2411. This tends to stick and can be quite difficult to release. And you can see that this chuck is a little bit shorter. This is a better drill. This is possibly a little handier with the hammer drill function. The right angle drill, it's okay. It's not the best tool in the world, but it sure is handy in a couple of those tight spots. And then the hacksaw. The M18, this is quite a powerful drill. It'll snap your wrist if you don't pay attention to what you're doing. But I find that in the workshop, these tools here are the handiest. So I wanted all of these to be in one location so I didn't have to go looking in different drawers or trying to remember where I last used it. I wanted one place to store all the drills and I'd have the battery chargers in that same area. I used some 2x6 material, cut a couple of blocks to support this at an angle so when it's on a wall, these will stay in. And a piece of plywood here to attach to the wall. The right angle drill is a little bit of a problem. It won't work in a hole like this, so I took a, a threaded fastener and turned the shank down on that. You just adjust the chuck and just hang it on there. This is a little over 1 and 5 eighths in diameter, about 42 millimeters. I drilled a 1 and 5 eighths hole, and then when I went in with a spindle sander and smoothed this out, that was a pretty good fit. A couple coats of polyurethane varnish, hand brushed. It keeps the wood clean and it's easy to dust. And then there's three lag bolts that hold this to the wall. The right angle drill, the chuck is a little sharp and it's partially covered by this light. So I just have a rod that holds that. These fit in there. And the larger M18 fits in there. And I have another drill on order that will fit here. And this will hang on two wooden dolls back here in the back. Above my drill storage unit, I have the two chargers for M12 and M18 batteries. And then an older job site radio that I use in the shop. This has proven to be a very handy setup and one which could be modified to work with most any brand of cordless drill.